Hello guys, today I will tell you how to do composition. Composition we mean when we create a complex class with our two lower classes or with low class. So in composition we make or create a complex class in which we use an object of an other class having its own attributes. For example, a car is a complex object having its attributes or classes of tires and uh, wind screen and their four doors etc etc so today i will t tell you how we will work on this exercise which is about a class point which has two data members x and y integer so i will definitely tell you how to create get and set methods then there is a class of triangle with three points now there are three points having three objects of this class point as is so provide appropriate constructor for this and display functions for this in the main so we have to pass the three points to a class of triangle so we will click over here new project so now I will make this here I go composition underscore T. So here we go. Now I click on next and then I will make an empathy project. So here we go. Now I will click over there and then I will add a CPP file. So here I will click and now I will name it as a source file because in this I will make my intimate so now I want to create a class so definitely I will click on this and then I will add a class of point here we go point so it will create a point dot header file in which we do prototyping as I told you how to in this we only write the prototypes of the function and in this I will write the definitions of the class of point as I also need a class of triangle so I will click over your class of triangle so as we know that point is a lower class so from we will start from the basics so I will including some of the header file which are necessary for all the programs which we have to made conyo.h then using name space std so this is my now private integer int x comma y so this is the two integer values now this is the default constructor default cons and now it is called destructor in this program we are not going to use destructor as there are two par parameters integer x and y so now I will do constructor overloading so now this is the your parameter constructor so now I will make a display function y display in this I will only tell you how to create your get or simple display function so I am not going to create your get and set method in this so here we go then I will definitely as constructors don't have <coughs> any kind of return there are no type of return type of constructor so here I will initialize my private members to zero so that the compiler does not give me garbage value so I will pass two integer and integer which will set my x and y so here we go it is called initializing x so x is a private member and a will pass into it and a will set the value of x so now y and in it 
b will first so x equals to a and y equals to b which value i will send to a will set x and which value i will give to b will set y so now i will create y first of all return type then the name of the class then scope resolution then display function so here we go then see out d x is so here we go x from next line d y is so here we go so this was a complete class i have made so now i will tell you how to create triangle class so now in this case i have to create private member as the in this class we have to create composition so for this purpose i will include that point file which has for to access x and y i have to include that header file so here i will include it so now in private i will make the objects of point a p1 for example then p2 and then p3 so these are the point of this so this is as it's showing you the error so i will tell you why it's showing here yeah, because it's about this structure as these all objects were called object it is a proof it is a whole class so we don't need to initialize this class so in its parameterized constructor i will pass three points so in this for tapping i will definitely create point point then once again point and then point so now that's the simple thing now i will create display function for it also here we go so now come to this point now from there i will remove this point a1 point a2 and then point a3 so now as these matter uh, data members of private have p1 p2 and p3 so for initializing them i will definitely use p1 and what will pass into it a1 so a1 will a1 will set p1 then definitely p2 will be set through a2 and then p3 will be definitely set through a3 so this was simple initializing or setting the values now i will create a display function here we go in this now this is a very tricky part of it as this was your display function of your point in this you are could displaying the triangle points on the console so in this i will write over here so this is the p1 so i will let here p1 dot display <coughs> so here what will i do i will definitely so now here return tab and the name of the class triangle and scope resolution and then display function and then i will remove this over so this was the right one so this is a very tricky part that these are the private members so when i will call p1 dot display the object p1.1 means that point one including x and y will be displayed then i will call it from p2 object p2 dot display and then when i will call it from p3 dot display it will show me the things so now in the main what will i'm gonna happen so now i will tell you in this it will display first point x and y in it it will display a second and in it it will play this third so now in its main implementation where i will include the header file point then i will also include my triangle 
file hydro file so then now I will make a uh, it main main function so here we go so now I need print a uh, two integers way which I have to use C out enter the X so C in a and then C out enter the Y so now I have to pass it to point I have to create a point so now I will definitely make the class or object of the class point so first of all I will create point then I will make here b1 as object and I am passing it a b so now this will a and b are passing to this and are setting to x and y which I will pass to a will definitely set x of the private member and then we have to create it so point is a class so as you all know that integer is a data type and point is a user defined data type so we have to create in it we create or make variables in it we create objects so now in for the other two object I will definitely do the same thing and don't worry about the all a and b this will definitely initialize once again to another objects so from 3 I will definitely pass to this and then I will create point of b3 and it will set a and b of the private members now all the points three points of the triangles having x and y points of the triangles x and y are set so now I have to create a class of triangle triangle now I will make the object triangle T in which I have to pass all the points objects so B1 B2 and B3 so here we go so now I what will I do I will simply write a T dot display so what's gonna happen in it and then get CH4 and so T dot display so once the p1 dot display is calling so it is calling the function of point this when I will call it from triangle p1 dot display when compiler reaches there it will move on to this and we'll see how the point p1 of it so now we will debug the program so here we go so I entered the value first of all 2 and 3 then I will 4 or 5 then 8 and 9 so these are the points P1 for P1 it will show me 2 3 for P2 it will show me 4 5 definitely and then for P3 it is showing me 8 and 9 for more beautiful things you can also write over there that for point 1 the point one so now as this function is not returning me anything p1 dot display p1 dot display is a white function as it don't return me anything so I cannot see out it so I will definitely move into this point and I will come over there and I will write over there see out the point two and then over there I will write the point three so once again we will compile the program from zero file here we go so now this time I will pass in one five nine six eight and seven so here we go the point p1 so the x is 1 the y is 5 for the point 2 the x is 9 and y is 6 and for point 3 it is 8 and 7 so it is a simple program 
related to composition thanks for watching video please like comment and share my video and please do not forget to subscribe my channel thank you